Hi, I'm Pete Gallivan. And I'm Claudine Ewing. We're going to start off the show talking about something that you like, fashion. We are both fashionable, so it works. Chad, tell us about Buffalo Fashion Runway. Definitely. So Buffalo Fashion Runway Black Carpet, it'll be a celebration of diversity through the arts. So we'll be highlighting local Buffalo designers, artists, dance crews, and poets. And it will be a celebration for Black History Month. So we'll have the designers curate at least one or two items geared towards the theme of Black History. And um, the poets, and they will create like a custom piece for Black History Month. Kane, why are you excited about this? I'm just excited to see the creativity in Buffalo showcased on a level that we're producing at this point. Um, we're really trying to connect two different realms of, of business with the startup community and, and with the creative community. And what we're really trying to do is, is create a room that shows exactly what Buffalo is and, and what Buffalo can be as well. You know, a lot of people don't think of Buffalo as fashion. It's a, this city isn't what comes to mind when you think of it. Yeah. Are you guys Wait trying to change that? Wait a minute, I don't know about that. Uh, except, uh, <laughs> except for Claudine. <laughs> you guys are changing that, uh, that, that image. Absolutely. I absolutely. I think, like I mentioned, the platform is one of the most important things. This the city is is budding with creatives that are looking for an outlet in in the support structure that we're trying to create with this collective. Definitely. Like I see Buffalo. I see the potential in Buffalo. Right. There is so much entrepreneurship, diversity. So much talent here. Right. And like we're a 30 minute plane ride from the city, two hour drive from Toronto. I see Buffalo as a hub or a future hub for fashion, for the arts, for creativity, for people to come, live, and thrive. Absolutely. I think we're in the midst of a renaissance here in Buffalo and, and with um, the attention and the effort that's being poured into the city and, and the surrounding areas, I think it only makes sense that we can do our part in the way that we see things and where our passions lie. Um, the event will be held at Northland Workforce Training Center on February 24th, 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. The link to buy tickets are on Eventbrite. And you all are honoring 10 icons. Who are these individuals? What's that about? <laughs> yeah, 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 so we don't want to give them all away, but um, we definitely wanted to celebrate not only models and arts, we wanted to celebrate people, black people that are doing great things in the Buffalo community. So we have some local influencers, some local leaders, the likes of Zanetta Hart, some Mark Talley's, Kendra Brims, right? I don't want to give away all of them, but we want to be, we want to celebrate them as they have done great things in this community. And it is Black History Month, you know, so we want to celebrate them as the icons that they are. Doesn't this show black history is history for all of us? I mean, look at us, right? Mm -hmm. yeah, that's awesome. And uh, as long as we're talking about the art, 